Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. This is my first video back of 2020. Technically it's the second one, but the uh, first video was already recorded, so this is officially me talking to you in 2020 for the first video, and I'm so glad to be back. Hopefully everyone had a wonderful New Year's and safe. And this week, I have a blue and white glitter design for you. I don't exactly know what to call this. Maybe I'll decide before the video is live. Who knows? Whatever the title of this video is, is the name of this design, I guess. And I want to say something before we get into the design. I'm thinking about buying some like fake nails and doing some videos with those instead of my like fingers in the videos or finger as most of the video is because sometimes I feel like I don't get enough time to wear certain designs before I have to remove them and start it over with a new design for another video. So if I did fake nails, I could do a design on my fingers and then do a design on fake nails and still have time to wear what's on my fingers a little bit longer. That way I'm not just like constantly erasing the design of my nails if I really like it. Because sometimes it makes me sad. So leave a comment to, on your opinions about doing the fake nails. And who knows, um, <coughs> it's a, if it's a very popular like design or whatever, I may make an entire set of fake nails for someone to purchase if they wanted to. I've been toying around with that too. So who knows? But anyway, let's get on in the, into this design to see how it's done. Like we always do, we're going to start off with the base coat to protect our natural nails. Now once the base coat is dry, we're going to put down our base color. Okay, now once our base color is dry, as you can see, I've gone and put some liquid latex down. And that's because we're going to do some glitter sponging. <laughs> I'm going to be using my little handy dandy wand sponge that I used in my New Year's Eve video and the video that was up last week and the reason I use it like I said I have keep forgetting to go and get makeup sponges but this works just as well things around here have been a little crazy and I haven't really been anywhere outside of the house for a while let alone going shopping but I have this and it works just well so we're gonna get started and that's all you do obviously it's going to take more layers of sponging to get the opacity. Now that we have put the glitter on, I have already taken off the liquid latex and cleaned up around the edges <coughs> so it looks better. And now we're just going to take the same white polish as we did for the base color and just draw in little details like 
you could call this a star or a snowflake and or whatever but you'll see what the details are Just like that, just keeping it simple. I'll be back with the final step. Now the last thing we're going to do is seal our design in with a glossy quick dry top coat. And here's the final look for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. It helps me know you like my videos. If you see big red subscribe button down below, that means you're not subscribed to my channel, so be sure to hit that subscribe. After you're done subscribing, be sure to turn on the post notification bell so you get notified when a video goes up so you never miss a video. Leave a comment for what you would like to see next, and I'll see y'all later. Bye!